Hi, I'm Clint Hahn, and this is 60 Seconds On Set. In this episode, I want to show you a quick tip on how to record double system sound and feed the same audio signal to your camera simultaneously. In this setup, I have an iPhone with Rode's iXY mounted on a Nikon D800, and by using a 3.5mm patch cable, connect one end of the headphone output of your iPhone to the mic input of your camera. Adjust the levels accordingly inside the Rode Rack app and the internal preamp within the camera itself to ensure you don't overdrive or clip your audio going from the phone to your camera. Make sure you monitor by plugging headphones into the headphone port of your camera itself. Here another example, I have a Nikon D800 again, mounted on a Zakulo Swiss cage with a mounted Rode NTG3 shotgun mic running into a Zoom H4n with an XLR connection. Now connect the headphone line output of the H4n into the mic input and adjust the output gain by boosting or attenuating the headphone volume trim of your H4n to control the amount of signal going to your camera. Again, monitor by using headphones through your headphone port by your camera. Now, keeping the camera preamp at a lower gain setting ensures that the self noise of the camera is kept to a minimum. Now, remember, there are no fixed settings for good gain structure, so I would recommend that you experiment with levels on both devices until you find a gain setting that gives you clean, clear, and intelligible audio with a healthy signal and minimal noise. Now, this entire method offers three things. One, the advantage of recording multiple channels of audio as a backup. Two, the ability to record audio direct to camera without the need to sync in post. And three, the benefit of recording better quality reference audio or an identical scratch track. And that was 60 seconds on set. Thanks for watching.